So what are your first thoughts of Melbourne or Australia? Um, it's not really anything special really, like... <laughs> I mean, did we get that on camera? The, give me the, it's cute, but I thought it was gonna be like very different from America. Yeah. It's it's not. Right. It's like the same thing. It felt like I just took a sixteen hour flight to come to New York. <laughs> oh, oh, that that car looks really nice. Wait till you go to New Zealand and that's when your mind will be blown. Oh, I've been there. Well, we are from New Zealand and we just want to oh, know. Oh, you are? Yeah, yeah, we're Kiwis. Oh, oh my God, okay, then let's, <laughs> let's build a tea. <laughs> um, what do you love about New Zealand then? I don't know, it was just very magical. I really liked it. I was on it for the Amazing Race, so my experience there was very different from like uh, just someone visiting. New Zealand, woo! It was just a crazy Did adventure. Did you jump so. on sheep? Anything like that? Sheep? Uh. Oh, guys, the, the accent is going to be an issue. Sheep. 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 <laughs> no, jump on them. <laughs> they so, don't usually like that. Yeah, we, don't, we don't do that. Okay. No, that's not a thing. Jumping don't make that sheep. a thing. When I rocked up in Melbourne uh, yesterday and today, I feel like I'm just hanging out with you all the time because you are everywhere. You're in the train station. Oh my God. Yeah, I went there today. It was Escape so crazy. Escape the night. It's yeah. all over the place. Yeah, pretty crazy. We're going to send our cameraman down there now to get some quick cutaways. <laughs> As you can see right now, look, there's posters of you everywhere. Ah, good day, everyone, and welcome to today's video where I'm finally showing you guys a tour of my bedroom. Who do you feel like you're talking to when you've got your camera? I guess the people that I communicate most with, like on Twitter or in the YouTube comments, I guess I feel like I'm talking to those type of right. people that I've actually interacted with. So you can almost um, picture them. Yeah, but it, it always feels like maybe like four or five people when it, it's really not, but in my head, it's just like a couple of people. When you come to a thing like VidCon and you're face to face with a lot of those fans, yeah. does it get overwhelming? It can, if it's like not in the correct setting. There was one time when I was in the VidCon in Anaheim and I just like walked into the convention like normal and it was the first time that I was completely surrounded by people um, who just were like grabbing at me and like trying to get a picture with me and it was it was terrifying. I was like, oh my God, hi everyone. <laughs> and then it became like, oh my God, I can't breathe. Like this yeah. is really scary. So now that doesn't happen. It's very like proper and set up um, in a very professional way. You've got a book coming out. Yes. How did you have time to write a book? Do you sleep? It's because I love the projects that I work on that I just like invest all my time 24 seven. I'm working on stuff, but it doesn't feel like work because I love doing everything. What's the book about? So it's a dystopian, utopian type of um, novel. It's set in the future after humanity has destroyed itself. Um, so not really fiction anymore because that <laughs> seems to be where things are headed. So I'm kind of just fortune telling. Um, the government put in laws where uh, families can only have one child each. Mm -hmm. um, like in China, under Mao? Yeah, they don't have that anymore, but it was kind of like inspired by that. So my story focuses on a family who had twins and the son gets to live a normal life while the daughter stays at home. And she lives her life through his eyes. And then oh. one day she finds out that she was actually the firstborn and she gets really upset and she leaves the house and um, like a whole story unfolds from there. What do you think about climate change? <laughs> this is not written on my yeah. cue but I just wanted to like... Oh, sorry, man, this is... Uh, yeah. Well, I think it's pretty evident with all yeah. the hurricanes and the yeah. burnings of our states in America, just how crazy and real it is. The silver lining to all those things is we can move forward and see the evidence that's right in front of our eyes and yeah. make a change. I like that you still have hope for the future. I do, yeah. and if not, my book <laughs> is, is a great map for what could be. <laughs> so we've got a game that we'd like to play with you. We've found some tweets. Well, tweets. <laughs> to <laughs> uh, tweets. Tweet. 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 Yes, tweet like a tiger. I'm tweet. just gonna stop talking. <laughs> uh, no. You have basically escaped the night as leading up okay. to Halloween. Yes. And we want to get into the Halloween spirit. Okay. So this is called Trick or Tweet. Ooh. Yeah, so you have to tell us whether this is a real tweet or whether it's a trick. Okay, cool. Okay, this first one is from Kim Kardashian. 
or is it? I have a really odd talent. I can smell when someone has cavities. I've never been wrong yet. They don't even have to be super close to me. Trick that seems or tweet. a little too specific, so I'm gonna say that's true. Yeah. Yeah. Justin Bieber, everyone have a great Labor Day. That was his American accent. I mean, that's simple, so I feel like, no. It's fake. Who wrote these? <laughs> You're right. You got two from two. Grace Helbig. Do you know her? I She's do. Here. Yeah, She's... I love her. Have you seen her since you've been in Melbourne? No. We're all kind of like hiding in our hotel rooms trying to get over this jet lag. Oh, so. very <laughs> yeah, nice. I think I'll see her tonight. You can ask her whether she said this. I literally just ate poop on purpose. Okay. Ate poop on purpose? Yeah. Oh my god. It goodness. was delicious. Hashtag my new habit. Hashtag not kidding. Trick or tweet? I'm gonna say trick on that one. It was real. Like, I think I'm gonna go see her at the party tonight. Yeah, maybe I'll stay away. <laughs> well, you can ask her about it. Nice icebreaker conversation. Right. <laughs> uh, Seth Rogen, remember bread? I don't get it. I don't get I don't it. So I'm gonna say real, because it doesn't make any sense. <laughs> I like that that's your philosophy on yeah. deciding whether something in 2017 is real or not. It's <laughs> yeah. like, makes no sense, it must be true. Right. Is it true? Yeah, yeah. you're oh, right. Okay. <laughs> Katy Perry, hope this massive zit on the back of my neck is a good luck sign for tonight. Not gonna lie, I always feel way more important with police escorts. She's weird and gross, so I'm gonna say that's true. It is. Yeah. Gosh. You're doing really well. Miley Cyrus, how do magnets work? Like, I get they attract, but how? Oh. <laughs> good question. <laughs> no, I, no, I was just pondering. I'm gonna say yeah. true. Yeah. <laughs> Fake. It was fake, but now we're all wondering how magnets really do work. And <laughs> recently, I've noticed I look at the clock when it's 11 11 all the time. Me! None of my Me. freaking wishes <laughs> ever come true. Me! Yeah. I love that. None <laughs> yeah. of your wishes have been coming true? No, they, I guess I they feel have. like you got a pretty good life. I just need to be relatable, you know? <laughs> <laughs> Can't be like getting all my wishes coming true. Like. <laughs> Thank it's, you so much. It's yeah, really course. cool to catch up with you. You're so nice. Oh, thank you. you I don't know why too. I was expecting because you're big and famous that you might not be nice. It's just because the cameras are on. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, so really just, awful. Awful. Yeah. <laughs> just, just leave horrible. the cameras on <laughs> when you time. exit. Um, <laughs> now, for people that are watching in New Zealand, uh, how can they track you down online? Uh, just my name, Joey Graceffa, anywhere. Yeah, simple. You know you've made it when it's when you can just type your name into a search engine. Mm, or if it was just Joey, but I don't think I'm that far. One day, like Beyonce and Madonna. Yeah, exactly. Joey. Yeah. Joey. <laughs> no. You've come up Dude, first. Dude, your name comes up first. first. Yeah. Oh my Joey God. Yeah. Joey Bragg, Joey Lawrence. You've made it. Cool. Okay, awesome. I want one too, just <laughs> okay. <next. laughs> Thank you so much yeah, for your time. Yeah, of course. Thank awesome. you, guys. So we've got a game that we'd like to play with you. We've found some tweets. Well, tweets. <laughs> <laughs> tweets. Tweet. Wait. Tweet. Tweet. Yes. Tweet like a tiger. A I'm tweet. just gonna stop talking. <laughs> no. <laughs>